come together and we're gonna have to realize that we're killing each other. Tonight, as, as a community remembers a grandmother killed in a hit and run in Hartford's North End, a 16 year old has been arrested in that case. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Dennis House. And I'm Denise DeCenzo. What was breaking news we first brought you yesterday? A 71 year old woman run over during a drive by shooting. The suspects were in a stolen car. Channel 3's Matthew Campbell is live from Hartford Police Headquarters. And Matthew, police are still looking for suspects in addition to this teenager, correct? Yeah, Denise and Dennis, they're actually looking for the other group involved in this shooting and talking with neighbors here today. They say that there's a lot more cooperation with police in this case as opposed to others because of who this victim is. This is the face of 71 year old Yvonne Smith. Family members confirm she was the innocent victim caught up in the aftermath of a drive by. I was shocked. I felt bad. I felt really bad. Just before 1.30 yesterday afternoon, police say people in two cars exchanged gunfire on Westland Street. As one car was trying to get away, the driver reversed, striking Smith as she was running for safety. I can't imagine for my grandma literally dealing, probably just grabbing a lottery ticket and then coming to grab meat to cook for me. And she's gone. You saw this surveillance first on Eyewitness News. This is what happened after the deadly impact. It shows the stolen car used in the drive-by crashing into a building, then two teens running from the car. Police took a 16 and 17 year old into custody with the 16 year old being charged today with manslaughter. The charges could be upgraded. Snitches get stitches. It's that's 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 over with. It's about justice. Hartford police today announcing this silver car involved was stolen in Manchester two days before. It's unclear if the minors will be charged under the new juvenile justice laws that went into effect at the beginning of the month. But neighbors say for the sake of Miss Smith, who is known as the beloved neighborhood grandma, they want swift justice. Now coming up at six, Miss Smith was in the Hartford's North End for decades, and we learned more about how she tried to prevent the same type of violence that ultimately got her killed. That's coming up at six, but for now, that's the latest. Live here in Hartford, Matthew Campbell, Channel 3 News.